What's up, everybody? It's been a while. Well, not really, but to me it hasn't. I didn't give y'all week three update, but this is going to be week three to four. Um, I've been doing a uh, pulling the plants in and out, so now I'm pretty much done. So I'm going to show you how to finish product right now. I'm not going to mess with it anymore. The only thing I'm going to do is pretty much just let it grow out. Added some more Laguidia. Added, um, Tella. I forgot the name of these plants. I'm sure y'all know that, the name of the plant. Trying to get a little red and green contrast in there. I added two stems in there. I removed the Java fern that was right there. That was blocking the little cutout I had for when I first got the tank. I had a filter in there. That was where the intake. But I'm pretty sure this is gonna grow up and it's gonna cover it and here it is this is some liquidity I picked up from the local fish store put one here put some more in the middle as you can see my original liquidity it's pretty much at the top um, I haven't I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet I, I'm gonna trim it down but I want to see what it does, you know, how red it gets, or if it flowers, or if it does anything, you know, I don't know if Lugwitty even does that, but added another um, bunch right here, and this is the final bunch right here, it's covering up my nubi uh, my nubius a little bit, so um, I don't know, thinking I might move that, I don't know yet, but as you can see, my crypts are doing great, Got some I got some green ones and I've got some red and some of the red is coming out now. Dwarf Satch doing fine. Just staying. Not much growth. I haven't seen any runners, but they're not dying. My tiger lotus is doing great. As you can see, there's a few more leaves. I'm about to get up real quick so sorry for the shakiness. And it's like every other day I'm getting a new leaf so that's one right there if you can see it right there oh, it went out of focus but that one's right there that's about to grow out and the majority of them are staying real red some are not red but um it's doing great it's my other side of Laguidia added five more well four more I was supposed to get five but when I got home it was um four rummy nose and some other had a red tail but I forgot what it was called some type of tetra but um, I put I just threw that in one of my other tanks and stuff because this one this tank I'm gonna turn it into just rummy notes tetras so that's what I'm gonna do for that tank still gotta catch a few more of the black neon tetras I caught four last night got a little bit to go put them in the other tank that I have going so today pretty much gonna try to catch them I know it's gonna be hell trying to catch this one little cardinal tetra but hey he's gonna have to go um don't know what I'm gonna do with him if I do get the nano tank I'm gonna get at my desk that's probably gonna go in there and a few more but my chore for today is to catch the rest of the black tetras so they could go to the other tank but here's the update on the tank people tell me what y'all think tell me if there's too much do y'all think if there's too much plants in there um, or should I pull something out should I keep it the way it is cause right now I'm not gonna do any more changes I'm just gonna let it grow out I leave that open space right there just for my quarry cats and I just like the contrast where you know I make the the tiger lotus the focal point but um that's all comment rate subscribe thanks for watching thanks for enduring with me and see y'all next time